This is News 8 at 11. Good evening to all of you. Two local lawmakers want an investigation into Hurlbut Care Communities, which runs several local nursing homes amid their decision to refuse universal COVID-19 testing of employees after deaths in their facilities. Hurlbut is citing HIPAA as a reason not to force testing. Tonight, we're looking into what kind of legal weight that argument holds. Jack Watson spoke with a lawyer today and caught up with those lawmakers this evening. Hurlbut Care Community says compulsory testing for employees is against federal law. Company President Robert Hurlbut argues, quote, any government agency or official who attempts to mandate universal testing of our nursing home employees or any company's employees would be directly violating federal HIPAA law. Those who try to mandate universal testing are politicizing the worst health care crisis that our country has faced in more than a century. Today we asked which specific part of HIPAA they're citing. They say the provided statement is all they're releasing right now. Local attorney Mike Berger says he doesn't see a law in place stopping the state from mandating testing. I'm not aware of any uh, statutory provision or regulatory provision that would prevent the government from mandating testing during a pandemic. New this week, the State Department of Health says if a nursing home worker tests positive, they can't go back to work for 14 days. State Assemblywoman Marjorie Burns represents Avon, the site of the Hurlbut home in question. She says she worries about what could go wrong if everyone under the roof isn't tested. I am just exceedingly concerned that this is going to potentially lead to a lot more positive patients and staff members. State Senator Patrick Gallivan shares that concern. He's looking ahead to the State Department of Health and Attorney General for answers. I'm not looking to find things wrong. I want to know that things are being done right, and I don't have the confidence that they are right now. And that's what I think an investigation will uncover. Supporters of mandatory testing of staff say carriers could unwittingly bring the virus into homes even if they don't show symptoms. Jack Watson, News 8. Thank you, Jack. Monroe County Health Commissioner Dr. Michael Mendoza also called for an investigation into a Hurlbut facility in our area. That was last week.